This is still such a, a deep team and a stiff test for Ohio State, who is in the midst of a seven-game unbeaten run. And off they go, sticks a breaking right off the faceoff. And it ends up being a breakout pass, that missed shot now for Minnesota. Blake McLaughlin trying to angle his way in. Here's Sammy Walker to pick up the pieces. Back on the point, Kester lets it rip. And Dobish is able to see that through the screen. Sedlocha now on the counter. Camille Sedlocha waits. Thiessen is in front looking for a rebound. And it's kept in Cole McWard, number three. Ohio State. Thiessen now the freshman right on, and Justin Close doesn't allow a rebound. Only the first big road test for Justin Close at net. We'll see how he does. He has not seen... 30 shots in a game yet. It's close. Looks that off. He thought he was going to handle it. Gildon now jumps on it. This is Dunlap. Dunlap in front. Quick shot. Close. Big save there on Jake Y. Wonder about the risk of too many men. Behind the net look. Jake Wise kind of backs away. Has a screen. What a nice save. It's a great look right here. That puck goes off of the Crookshank's leg and then... Close has to react there. You see just a little. What a great reaction with the right leg. Looking to reclaim possession. Bros bothering Lowry on the forecheck, but Lowry showing his composure and makes the right outlet pass. Joe Dunlop rips the puck across ice, and Michael, I think it's Michael Gildon trying to play it, trying to get off the ice. Lucius thought about it. Jackson Lacombe moves it around. Back to Chaz Lucius. Low shot. Dobish. The save, ready to take this face off opposite Jake Wise. A power play that has struggled versus a penalty killing unit that has struggled. There's Dobish, gets a piece of it with the right pad. Looking for the stick there of Grant Crookshank. Minute 15 to go in the power play. Lucius is in front. On the rebound there is Tristan Bros firing it high and wide. I like the mentality from the Gophers. You talked about it, they got to shoot the puck. They're listening to what's what's going to happen because they may not score here, but it could create opportunities down the road. Kester gets the shot through, cradled there by Yacht, and it sneaks out to center. 30 seconds remain in this advantage. Blake McLaughlin, here's Brodzinski. Walker inching in, down to Brodzinski, and Jakob Dobish closing the door. The net just by a hair. But then Brodzinski puts it at the net. I love that shot because that could just go like the cross corner dump it. Haven't seen a lot of hitting so far. Lacombe shot changing directions. As that was deflected by Huglin in front. And it's Ryan Johnson on the backhand. Georgie Merkiloff keeping this attack alive. Said Locha right in front. It's McWard in Ohio State. Sneaks the first one in. Jakob Dobish but the turnover there. Jordy Murkoff kind of leaves a soft chip down low. You thought said Locha had one of his forwards, but no, it's Cole McWard coming from the backside. The defenseman, all the Gophers. Unable to cross that line. Gildon, a little back and forth. Jake Wise, and that's right off the chest of Justin Close. 18 goals for number 10 for Ohio State. Look at Lowry, so relaxed, said Locha from the boards. Patted aside by Justin Close. And it's Colin Schmidt feeding the point. Brinkman a shot. Rebound is available. Dobish not once, but twice. Jakob Dobish stopping Minnesota there on the doorstep. And Ryan Johnson back and forth they go. Now they'll hit the man with speed. Sammy Walker bearing down on goal. He hits Dobish right in the chest with that shot. Things opening up a little bit now. Tearing forward. Here's Camille Sedlocha, cuts, fires, close, big pad save there on Sedlocha. Locha coming down the wing, he gets Johnson a little, gets his shoulder drive, stays on the back end. What a toe save from close, my goodness. And then the net goes off, I'm not sure if that decent rebound would have counted, but the Gophers make a good shot block. But that, had, that thing was pegged for the post, not sure if it might have went in, but close with that nice toe save. 2-0 here late in the first period. This is Ohio State team who was flourished at home. Now it's Sammy Walker. Cuts. Brodzinski fires. Dobish the save. They're not unbeatable, but are they unsweepable? Yeah, I mean, they, they play so hard. And you heard the coaches talking. He, he mentioned UMD. 
Here's Pitlick to steal back and forth around. Oh, and they find a hole there, squeezing it through the five hole. And Minnesota, big late period goal. Freshman line, the turnover up the middle. Pitlick to Huglin, back to Pitlick to Lucius. And that puck might have hit McWard in front of Dobish, then squeezes through as everyone wants a touch of the puck. Finally get to Lucius, and that goes right through Dobish's legs. What a tic-tac-toe. Really quick passing from the Gophers to eliminate him. A tree lore right back on the case in front. Westland fans on it. Gabriel puts it wide. They're off the end board. Singleton missing it. And you look at put it right straight across instead into the net. Ryan Johnson. Now it's Sammy Walker flying over the line. Quick shot. Oh, what a goal. Tristan Bros from Sammy Walker. Just like that, Minnesota has their first lead of the night. It looked like the Buckeyes might have had that covered, but Sammy Walker with the sauce. Oh, my goodness. Right over Gabriel's stick. And then Bros goes bar down the back. I think it's back bar there. Yep, right off the projected off of Buckeye shin pad back out to center. Johnson shot easily stopped by Jakob Dobish. It was Ohio State with the bright start getting the opening goal, but Minnesota finishes a flourish there. Jake Wise. Close the save from that shot from the point, and it's Mason Nevers. Works it around. Low rise shot. Now pushed in front, but a lot of Minnesota sweaters there, and it's Blake McLaughlin now. It's Chad Lucius scored his ninth goal of the season back in the first period. Pitlick walking in. Dobish stopping that low drive. And it's the scene trailing as Georgie Merkulov, low blast. Said Locha there on the rebound, but unable to unleash the shot. Jaden Leslie's in front. Puck there stuck on the back of the goal. Penalty upcoming. Will Rydell in from the point. It's a really subtle little play here. Leslie's got it almost. He put gets his stick stuck on the net. There you see Stoddicker. Now he's kind of wrapped up as well as he struggles to move it up the boards. Kept in by Lowry. 70 seconds to go on the power play. A small little rebound for Justin Close. Grant Gabriel holds it in. Watch out. Whiffs on that pass. Rhett Pitlick in shoots. And Jakob Dobis able to stop Rhett Pitlick on a partial breakaway. This could have been a huge turning point. Buckeyes on the power play. Grant Gabriel gets a whiff and Rhett Pitlick on his way. Tries to make a quick shot going from his backhand. Watch this little cut, subtle move. Tries to go to his forehand, kind of sneak it by Dobish, but with that right pad, he does a great job of keeping that five hole and that right side protected. Along with Tate Singleton. Cherimetta feeds the point. Will Rydell launching the shot and Justin Close playing against the Gophers. Singleton, there, Fish, the big physical defenseman. Carl Fish. Doing his thing as it's Blake McLaughlin now looking for an exit. Swarm. Guzzo here as he a little tomahawk on Sammy. Here's Bros. Lacombe inching in there with Pitlick. Bros shooting. This time Dobish able to get across. And Ohio State returns to full strength. Watch out. Here's Cooley leading the brigade. Shoots close to save. And he deals with that minor rebound. Cooley had a little more time there. He had two guys going in the net, kind of playing a shot for a rebound there. I'm not sure that's the type of play you want when you have a clean opportunity like this. He had his head up the whole way. He sees Guzzo going, and he's almost like looking to get a rebound against the Badgers last week. Had a depth guy that they transferred in last year. Singleton, the quick drive off the faceoff. Close had to be ready, as well as the puck bouncing. Settled down by Jake Wise. Dunlap swings it wide, able to get a one-handed shot attempt away, fended off by Justin Close. It's Lacombe on the point. McLaughlin, the shot, big rebound there. Sammy Walker's denied by Dobish. The Buckeyes need to stay within one. Been striking distance. That puck, I think it banked off of 
Brodzinski, almost like a shin pad pass, but he's... Cherometa now guides it back to the point. Mason Lowry. Grant Gabriel. Dunlap turns it over. Sorensen the other way, but you see the hustle from Ohio State to get back. Joe Dunlap, who turned that puck over. This is Huglin. Lucius again in the far corner. Huglin comes in to support. Fish from the point, that low drive, snared by Jakob Dobish. And he just loves playing with Jackson Lacombe. You, you mentioned it earlier, but he knows his role on that pairing. Plays it to a tee, and it helps benefit number two. Right up front, they score! What a pass, the finish from Aaron Huglin. It's off. Pitlick gets it back to Lucius. He's just trying to put it at the net, then Pitlick gets it. Again, three, three passes, so to speak. For the Gophers, this freshman line getting it done. And Huglin with his fifth of the year. I think Dobish thought he was going to try to go. Along with Tristan Bros, but Ohio State able to escape the center. Just playing it safe. Justin Close will keep it for a faceoff. This looks like the Buckeyes don't have any cohesiveness going up the ice, getting some offensive momentum. Oh, penalty here. Yeah, you're right. Huglin back and forth. Can someone score a power play goal this weekend or at least tonight? This would be a big one. Lacombe, and that's right on. No rebound allowed from Jakob Dobish. Blake McLaughlin. Oh, Sammy Walker off balance. Now Westlin shooting close to save with four seconds to go in the period. Then Gustav Westlin comes out of the box. Unfortunately, he has no momentum. Kind of had to stop to corral. The Ohio State, though, they amp it up in the third, but Minnesota, conversely, is also a strong third-period team. Kristen Burroughs knocked down. Fish from the point, couldn't get that shot through. Dunlap, watch out, in the clear, on a breakaway. Dunlap in, shoots, scores! Joe Dunlap! the play as he gets out makes that block and then he know he sees that puck is going to his defenseman and he's screaming we can hear it from here he's screaming for that puck getting it up to him he goes backhand back to his forearm makes that fake gets close going the other way and tucks it in and momentum has shifted in a matter of seconds oh, Dunlop getting it done for the Buckeyes Singleton Dropping it off. Trelor, the backhand shot. That was a tough one. Off the chest of Cloak. A lot of players falling down in this third period. Wise cuts and fires. Oh, and Close keeps that out. Buckeyes trying to come all the way back. That puck so lively. Gildon throws it at the net. Close kind of just knew he needed to get over there. Kind of blindly gets back. Now he sees it all the way. Actually, he spun the correct way. I'll tell you, goalies to... Not back themselves into the net. He keeps bouncing puck for Tate. Singleton settles it down. Gonna whip it in front, but instead it's Brinkman emerging with it out of the dust. Bros kicks it back on the point. Jakob Dobish well out of the crease to make that save. Another one of those nice passes, but Lori gets his stick to thwart the opportunity. And a penalty. On the play, interference the call. And then as Singleton's trying to get past Brinkman, Brinkman gonna go. Oh. Gildon in front, Westland shooting. Justin close down to make the save and doesn't allow a rebound. Gildon goes down low, they do a little give and go. Touch pass to Westland. Didn't get McWard, Lowry. Merkulov shooting. It's close makes that stop. Georgie Merkulov. McWard fires. Patted aside. Throwing it back in front looking for a wraparound try, but instead it's Minnesota up and out. Dragging it in here is Merkulov. Was looking for McWard right in front. Facing the shot. 
And the stop again by Justin Close. They're in front clearing it out because McWard was right there hoping for a rebound, but Johnson gets the clear. Seem to find their rhythm here. Trelor, the shot, close to save, the big rebound out in front. They push it safely to the near board. Six points in eight games coming in, and he has carried the decor tonight. Here's McLaughlin, and he just runs into Dobish. Man against goalie there, and the Dobish didn't budge. Gabriel over skates. Pitlick will push it in deep. Lucius just trying to create a rebound from a bad angle. Minnesota's Ryan Johnson now. Like maybe too many men. Gophers got away with that there, not sure. What a clear there by Blake McLaughlin in the block. Final 15. Feasting the shot, guided to the corner by Justin Close. Five seconds to go. They whiff on it from center. It doesn't matter tonight. University of Minnesota.